close to the ground. Oh, little Fuzzy never dies from gas in here. Just falling, crushing, Chitauri, Wait, water. hang on. Did you say Chitauri? Oh, I did, didn't I? Such a funny sounding word. What the boy is in the melee range? This is impossible! I thought I'd never see these markers again! I hope I never would! Shatari scum! You couldn't have warned us that Shatari were hiding out in this cave? They aren't always. That's not like we just wanted to kill the alive out there. You're the ones I'm talking about, Stargast? I'm familiar with eyeball guys, yes. What I don't get is why they be here. Feel free to ask them. Man, what is this, like the worst timeline? Oh. Bye-bye, <laughs> little guy! Coming! Yikes! I think these boss touched a nerve! Ready! I well, can stab the sword lake was our hours. Hellbender's goons are on the other side! Hey, Just where are you going? Payback from Hellbender is literally oh, the last thing we need right now! Ha! Called it! Need I remind you that you are the reason she's hunting us? Don't these guys know how to let bygones be bygones? Hey, at least they didn't bring an army of them jelly things okay. for them. Can you imagine? Man, I hated those things. You were saying? Just had to jinx us, didn't you? Hey, anyone notice it just happens to be the monster I said? I suppose you want nice. the credit for that, too? I really like that pink shirt. Before I die. Tunnel up! I'm having a hard time fragging him out there, Quill. Destin scutbags know how to dance. You're staying one step ahead of us, that's for sure. Open no ideas here, Peter. Hmm. You think they've got all the moves out there? The only moves out there? Well, I say lies. I am fooled. You said it. Let's take a stand right in this moment. Stare in the eyes of our opponents and fight until only one of us remains. Who's with me? It's gonna be fun! Great! Definitely going the right way, right? Watch your butt! <laughs> It was him or me, and it wasn't gonna be me. 
fog of fear, faced fully forthright. You okay, Mantis? Oh, hey, Gamora, you look less depressed. Wait, we went over that already, didn't we? Yeah, we did. That thing of yours is still bothering you, though, right? What thing? I'm fine. Let's just focus on helping. Stop the down. Does this cave go? Legends say the entire planet is hollow. Nice. Heads up. More than rock monsters. Maybe we just got off on the wrong foot. They're rock people. I don't think they're looking to make amends, Quill. Oh, maybe I can help. I think I speak their language. Chop, chop, Gamora. Oh. <laughs> Nope. Up there. Come on. Really? Who would want to live in this hole? Why go so? No, it doesn't go to the wrong, but something happens. Hey! Don't suppose you guys know how to heal our buttons? You're not telling me you're only making them He's strong, but they're slow. Don't let tracks hear you say that. Move it. Not personal, but you guys gotta die. They're probably thinking the same thing. <laughs> as well as expected. I was sure. Oh, maybe I just haven't learned it yet. I think I picked up the word kill. But anyway. The fog doesn't seem to bother whatever these giant things are. Maybe they're just smart enough to not wander around it. Unlike some people. I know why we're doing it. And don't think Drax won't hear all about it either. Oh, is this the one where little Fuzzy does something heroic? Hard to say. I think it's pretty easy to say he won't. You, most of all, should be willing to give someone Ooh. another chance, Gamora. <clears throat> okay. If we do cure Drax, we can make up a story about how we had to one of a kind monster. Oh, you won't have to make that up. Just to uh, assume you got your timelines crossed again. Under costume? No, under collectible. This looks like something Rocks. Gamora could use. I've only found the ones so I can talk with Gamora about. Are there. How can an entire planet be hollow? Doesn't it need a core or something for gravity or atmosphere? Got no, any it's other not science planet. words you want to throw out there, Gamora? Electromagnetic field? <laughs> um, guys. I know, little fuzzy. 
And it is the only way forward. Wish the big man would stop his sulking and explore this place with me. So many nooks and crannies, like those breakfast bricks we had once. At least can fight some of the beasties down here. He needs to get the golden blood flowing again. Stretch his legs, show the world the what for again. Ain't been the same since what happened. Happened to him. Just a husk of his former shell. Can they say or blame him? A Kuvahi thing to do to go through. Worst part of this place is the lousy dump everywhere. What's happening? He sees what lies ahead, and I see what lies behind. Uh uh. No way. No flarkin' way. It doesn't seem that wet. Like medium wet. I ain't walking through a flarkin' monsoon! Maybe there's a way to use those plants to divert the water. We're a team. We'll figure it out. Are we seriously gonna let this keep us from saving Drax? Yes. Ah, you save him while I drown! How does it even grow down here? I don't know. Those big leaves could be useful. Like a dam. Dam what? Yes! Nope, it's stuck somewhere. It must still be stuck somewhere. What did you guys do without me? Yeah, where oh where would we get another gun? Gamora, let's climb up there. Get eyes on the problem. The problem is that Rocky needs to suck it up. Yeah, good luck with that. In Little Fuzzy's defense, he has died drowning in far less water than this? Exactly! Wait, what? This doesn't seem absurd to you? He's got a thing with water. What do you want me to do? You're supposed to be his leader. Have you met Rocket? You're the almighty Star-Lord. You say something? Got a joke? Bullseye! I'm not sure if I do. I do. What? Hey, Bug Lady, exactly how many times have you seen us die horribly? Oh, it's uh, too bad to pass. I always have to stop around 50. Great, that's 10 apiece. Oh, no, 50,000, little fuzzy. And how are you can live? I think that's what you said. You didn't see any place I could turn it. I could try blowing Is it, it up. I guess. No! Remember last time you blew something up? Okay, fine. Mm. Figure something else out. Oh. Maybe you should go up there. I can torch these things with a little pew pew. There it, there it is. Yes! I can't believe that works. Half works. Come on, it's like 50% less wet. I'm 0% interested. All right, I'm on it. What do you think, Rocket? Doesn't seem that bad. Translation Rocket, don't. Rocket, don't like wet. We get it. It's a scary dark cave. We're all probably gonna encounter things we don't like. True. But nothing as much as Little Fuzzy doesn't like getting wet. Never underestimate someone's deeply rooted fear, Sir Fry. Especially when you do not understand the root. Okay. Anyone else suddenly missing Drax's anecdotes about the death? Oh, you know he has some Katathian fairy tale related to our current situation. Like the Katathian equivalent of Jack and the Giant Beanstalk. Hey, Groot, can you get me up there? I am Groot. He's on his way. Just tell him how high. I am Groot. Thank no. you. 
It ain't none of their business. What's to understand? I ain't a fan of drowning. Water hey, if I jump, you can catch me, right? Guess we'll find out. That's not very reassuring. Just don't screw up the jump. <laughs> Why don't we just leave him behind and focus on saving Drax? He'll still be here on the way back, and if he isn't... Okay. Too bad you don't have these sweet guns, Rocket. Keep it up and I'll swipe him in your sleep. Okay, I think that's all. I hope that's all. You're kidding. Oh. Mantis, any of those realities where we just leave Rocket here, hypothetically speaking? Uh, it's actually kind of refreshing. Like a quick shower. What do you say, Rocket? I ain't ever showered either, and I ain't gonna start now. <laughs> One more time, Groot. Yeah. Right about there. But unfortunately, sure, I think get them all. The water, but they're growing in the wrong direction. You're the only plant that grows that fast. Up there. A little more help. Uh, right there should be fine. Yep, I'll do it. Well, I don't huh? see What's your hurry? anything. What? I told it doesn't you to go before we left the ship. Thanks, God, Peter. Oh, uh, thanks. No, that should be all of them. Seriously. So this Jack Beanstalk guy, is that an Earth hero? Kinda. Basically, he plants some magic beans and they grow into this giant plant, which... Let my rocket go! Huh? And Moses. Are we supposed to know who that is? Part the Seas guy? Oh, with the tentacles, right? What? No! no. Anyway, <laughs> thanks, Quill. Really. What do you say, group? Now that we got the whole team together? Absolutely. A dry rocket is a happy rocket. So this we could have left happy? him here. Oh yes, you should see some of the dark versions of Little Fuzzy. Or maybe you shouldn't. No, we couldn't. You really, really shouldn't. You know what, Lou? Does Crab Corridor ring any bells, Mantis? Pretty sure this is the wet part. But what now? I thought we just did the wet part. Oh, it gets worse. Much worse. Guys. Come on, get through. Oh, we all good. Oh, we all go through. Okay. <laughs> Sounds dry. Everyone okay? I'd be seeing stars if I could see anything at all. Yeah, this ain't good. So, about all them futures where we die. Has he always been able to do that? He says he don't like showing off. Thanks, buddy. No, I don't gotta tell him. Oh, right. The thing that you tell us in the dark. It's really important. No, it ain't. Shut up. We're among friends, Rocket. It's nothing, okay? Just... The lab I was in did tests on me in tubes of water, and it sucked. It really, really sucked. Sensory deprivation experiments on Half World. I heard of those. Sensory deprivation was like a vacation compared to the other things. And that's why you hate getting wet. Clark, I had no idea. Don't make a big deal out of it. Just prefer to keep dry, is all. So, how long do we gotta wander around smashing our shins on rocks? Imagine it's a metaphor. You're in the physical darkness, and that reflects Green Meanie's mind. 
Ooh, this part. Ooh. Okay, anyone else getting really fed up with little Miss Cryptic? Okay. Pretty? <laughs> Give me a break. At least it seems less dark through here, and less wet. Works for me. Mantis, anything in particular we should be looking out for? I'm trying to remember. I think this is where it gets loopy. Now it gets loopy? Uh, there's that creepy fog again. It's always here. Always. Until it is. What's that supposed to- Shh. I don't- More Hellraisers. Wait, yeah. But it ain't those Flarknards. It's them creepy eyeball things from the QZ. I'm definitely hearing Hellraisers. Then you ain't hearing right. It's eyeball I things. I can't tell. Shh. What do you mean, shh? Start by strike. Shh. And about what? Shh. There's a new way out. So it was nothing. I think it depends. It's got something to do with the freaky fog. So the key all along was to keep quiet? Apparently. Every time you name an enemy, it has the power to make that enemy appear. Yeah, like that was ever gonna happen. I saw so many versions of us fighting so many different things, but the source? It's not done with us yet, Guardian. Yeah, well, let's just keep her eyes open and her mouth shut. The fog entity has retreated for now. There's no immediate risk. Yeah, no offense, Bug Lady, but nothing you say means anything anymore. So the fog is an entity now? Yes! Sort of. Ugh. Don't be frustrated, little fuzzy. We're all still alive. That's super rare. Obviously, if some fog monster's trying to kill us, it means we're getting closer to whatever it is we're looking for. That kind of makes sense. And if this fog monster can make bad things appear, maybe the opposite is true. Like, if we all say cure Drax, maybe that's what we've been looking for the whole time. I wish, Star Guy, but no. One time she gives a definite answer. Just like that! In one possible timeline, we all get smushed. Great! Yep. Let me guess. Further down. Oh, you want to say that? And the whole galaxy. Let me get back to you. 